Hello everyone, this is Pastor Don here and I am at the school and I'm looking at a whole truckload of food we're taking to the villages today. And uh, what's, what's awesome about it, this is, this is my friend Onav. Onav was one of the people that were on the property, uh, original signers of the property. But uh, he's, I don't know how old he is, but he can lift this stuff and, and uh, I can't even touch this stuff. And he picks it up all day long. But anyway, I'm showing you this because that's a whole truckload of food. But as I walk down this noisy classrooms and they're talking and everyone's speaking, I'm going to come into this room. It's loaded down with food. I mean, I, when we loaded up the truck, I thought, wow, whew, there's a lot of food. And then uh, I walked down the hallway of the schoolroom, and this is the rest. This is our afternoon right here. Uh, our morning is right there in that truck, and our afternoon is right here. So praise God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for making this happen. I cannot imagine what it's like to be sitting in the village being hungry. Your children are hungry. Your grandchildren are hungry. And we show up in that red truck uh, loaded down with food uh, to give them uh, my message today to them spiritually is going to be whose report are you going to believe are you going to believe the same report about haiti it's always going to be this problem it's always going to be this way or are you going to be the report of the lord that says in jeremiah 29 11 there's a hope and a calling for their lives their children's lives their grandchildren's lives their grandchildren are right here right there i have their grandchildren here uh in this school right here so we already know there's a hope and a calling for all of them. Here's another one. So we already know there's a hope and a calling for all of them. And the school here is part of that process to instill that in them. This is gasoline on the fire when it comes to the gospel. To teach the widows and the elderly and those who have children to let them know that this matches the vision. This matches the love of Christ. We keep telling them how much God loves them. This proves it to them. So thank you, thank you, thank you for everyone who helped us to do this. You're making a difference here in the nation of Haiti. God bless you.